male deputies. Well, thanks to Blaine, I have this game called Rising World. So, this is totally blind. It kind of has a Minecraft feel, but with better graphics. Since I'm starting the game, it looks like the sun is rising that direction. I could be wrong, so I'm going to call that direction east. But then again, there's not a whole lot of difference. I, it's really hard to tell wh which direction the sun is coming from. There's a horse. Maybe if I look at a tree, I can see... Um, yeah, that's light rays. This, there's the sun. That's definitely the sun. So that is east. I don't know that I have a compass or anything. It's the first step. Welcome to a new world. You will notice that you already have a stone axe in your inventory. First of all, you should use it to collect some wood. Take your axe, go to a tree, and cut it down. You need to hold the action key. Now cut the fallen tree into logs and pick them up. Alright, let's 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 go do that. Hey, horsey. Are you going to be my new pet? Oh, and there's a cow. Do I have to pick things up, or... I'm not seeing anything dropping yet, so maybe I have to do this considerably more. Watch out, horsey! I don't want you to get hurt. Mm. I can't seem to pick anything up. Maybe I have to hit this some more. Alright, now let's see. It says F to pick things up. I don't I don't know how to do this. Ah. Okay, so now do I... Hmm. Ah, okay. I get a target, it changes into a hand, and I press F. Alright. Okay, so I now have some wood. I wonder if I can get more from this. Or if that's it. Let's look at the journal. Next. Open your inventory. Click the crafting at the top to get the crafting. Meaning on the left you can choose a category. You select the item you want to craft. On the right you can see a small preview of the desired item. In the middle you find a description as well as the required amount of resource sources. Are you upset little horsey? What, what you got you going so much? Alright, let's see. Uh, small shelter, fireplace, skewer, grill spit. Well, I guess I should build... Um, a shelter. Um, but I'm gonna need sticks. Uh, how do I do this? Stick needs one lumber. Well, let's, let's craft the lumber, since I can't seem to craft a stick. Um, I still can't craft a stick, alright. Or maybe I am crafting sticks, okay. So I have crafted four sticks. And I find it difficult to read some of the text. 
Like the green on gray is hard for me to read. I just have bad eyes. I need stone to make a fireplace. So the see a shelter. I need 32 sticks. Okay. So let's just make uh, more sticks. All right. I don't have any. How many sticks do I have? Oh, this is confusing. I think I have 16 sticks and I need. 32. Let's cut down another tree. Well, hey, at least there's lots of animals here, right? Then I press F. I think I need to change the F to a different key because that's ah controls. Let's see, drop item. I already changed this. Um Okay, let's change this to an E and save it. A pig and cow and horses around here. Hello, little animals. And get more wood. So apparently I have hunger and thirst on the lower right. Don't push me around, cow. This is my world. You're not the boss of me. I'm the boss of you. That is a female cow. Oh, look, it's a um goat. Hello, goaty. Oh, apple tree. Ooh, I can pick apples. There's dinner. Dinner, folks. I've already got dinner, and it's only day one. Hee <laughs> Apples aren't much of a dinner, though, but they're nothing. Okay, let's look at the inventory again. All right, I have a apples or cherries or cherries. I have some sticks. I have some birch logs. Okay, let's go to the crafting menu. Hmm. Alright. Let's make pieces of log. Then we can make sticks. How much do I have now? 28. The interface is kind of clunky. So can I make a shelter yet? Oh no, I need 32. Okay, do I have... Yes, I can... Make a small shelter. All 
right. It's good to have shelter, right? All right, so let's go back to the journal. Crafting shelter. First, you need to turn your wood into sticks. Can be done. Find a good location and place the shelter. Aim at the ground and hold your right mouse button. Once that's done, you can sleep in the shelter. This will skip nights. This will also update your spawn location, i.e. if you die, you will always respawn there. The next step would be to craft a workbench now. Okay. This grants you access to more crafting recipes. Collect more wood if necessary and open crafting menu again. And switch to the category crafting stations. Craft a workbench. Alright, I want to need more wood for that. Um, uh, that's a big, okay. Lots of animals around here, interesting. It's a little bit tedious having to like the 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 you know you gotta chop the tree basically like twice and then turn it into stick well logs and then sticks before you can really make anything. Um. The graphics are pretty good. I mean. As far as the world graphics and the the, the avatars kind of meh, but the grass looks good, the trees look good, the animals look good. How come I can't target this? I can crouch down here. There we go. I had to kill the grass covering it up. This place doesn't have much in the way of landmarks. So, I'm kind of using this tree as a landmark. And... I'll cut down this tree. Oh look, it's a sheep! They have all kinds of animals here. It's pretty amazing. Because most games, you know, they might make a few animals, but... This one seems to have a lot. That's nice. You know, I wish it would just go into my inventory and, you know, Seven Days to Die, in the early alphas, you had to press the key to pick up your stuff, but I think I thought it was a, a big improvement when they made it, so it just automatically went in your inventory. I mean, you don't want to grind down the player in in too much drudgery because this is supposed to be for fun right so where should I build my shelter hmm Any more? Any 
pieces. Okay, so this is Maybe I want to get on top of a hill here. And take a look around at the surroundings. If I can get up this hill. Ooh, what's this? Let's check this out. It's like a... Ooh. <gasps> a bow. A record. Ride of the Valkyries. And a rake. Bones. Yeah, let's just clean up some of this junk. It's not letting me. Uh, I'm getting thirsty, apparently. I haven't, uh, Found a source of water yet. Hmm. Oh, look, I can go up onto the roof. Oh. So now. I wonder, should I put my shelter on top of this roof for safety purposes or to protect me from the elements? Should I put it inside or should I not use this at all? Hmm. You know, I wish I could, uh, Oh, that is cracking. Look at that. I get this thing to crack. I want to remove this debris. Doesn't really look like it's cracking though. Ah, it finally went. Clean up the house a little bit. Over there. Can I pick up those? They went away. Huh. Alright. So it says something about, uh, To place the shelter, aim at the ground and hold your right mouse button. Uh, 
It's getting dark, I can tell. Okay, um... Yeah, I did what it told me to, and it's not placing the shelter on the ground. I don't know how I'm supposed to do this. What's that? Oh, uh, it stops it from rotating. Okay. Ah, oh, I have to put it there, I guess. Um... Placing small shelter, okay. Alright, I now have a shelter. And the sun is setting. make uh, I need stone to make a fireplace I don't know how to make a stone uh, let's look I mean I don't know where to get stone I don't know where to get water let's look at the journal okay it says I need to make a workbench so this is very uh, Minecrafty. So let me find. Um, oh, it's getting dark. Let me go in near my shelter. Um, inventory, crafting. Let's go to crafting station. Workbench. Need to craft tools or objects. I need 16 lumber. Alright. Lights. One stick. I need a stick Let's craft a stick craft a torch I got light, folks. Okay, let's go back to trying to do the workbench. The 
Let's make a wooden torch mount. Yes, indeed. Alright. Oh, look at that! I got light! Awesome! Alright, now. Crafting. Crafting stations. I need more lumber. Make a workbench. Where am I going to put my workbench? Right here, I guess. Hmm, it's not going to let me? What? Oh, it was too too much into the wall, I guess. Alright, I have a workbench. Alright, let's go back to the journal. Once you have placed it in the world, you can access it by pressing key F, which I changed to an E. While well, aiming at it, you should see a small hammer icon. They need to make the icons larger. There are much more different workbenches. Each of them is used to craft particular items and objects. Current crafting station. Workbench. Workbench tier 2. Saw bench, block bench, loom, anvil, and furnace. You should start mining some stone now. Simply use your pickaxe for that. Aim at the ground and hold the action key. Note, stones and ore go into your inventory automatically. Oh, that's good. To explore caves, you should consider... To craft a torch as well as a torch holder, both can be crafted at the workbench. A torch holder is needed to mount torches on walls. Maybe you have already noticed the small hunger and thirst indicators. When they turn red, you will slowly lose health. You can satisfy your hunger and thirst by eating fruits or meat. Watermelons, for example, are admirably suited to quench your thirst, while meat satisfies your hunger effectively. Keep in mind you should cook the meat before eating, but don't cook it too long to prevent it from burning. Alright, well I need something to drink. Um, can I eat my cherries? Will that help my thirst? You ate some cherries. It is affecting my thirst. So it's helping. Doesn't seem to be affecting my hunger much, but at least I'm not, not going to die from thirst, right? I ate up all my cherries now. Hmm. 
Sticks, a rake, and a bow. Oh, look! If I use the mouse wheel, I can go through the different things. So I have a bow, but I have no arrows. Got a rake. All right. Now it said um, that stones and rocks would automatically go into my inventory. Um, can't see very well out here. I'll cut down this tree. I should make another uh, torch. And have that handy so I can uh, light my way. Got to figure out how to get stone. I'm going to make this my side door because that door that I came in is just, it's on like a cliff. So I don't like that. Tools. I need stone and iron. Okay, so I guess I'm going to sleep the night because I can't really do anything in the dark. So I hope you've enjoyed this. Please give me a thumbs up, comment below, and don't forget to subscribe. In the next episode, I'm going to try to get some stone and iron and all that good stuff. See you later, guys. And thanks for getting me this game, Blaine. I like it so far. We'll see you guys later. Bye.